Yeah, yeah. Little dragon's dogma. Let me make sure my mic is good as he pulls up stream on his phone because he doesn't want to swap tabs because he's a little nerd. Let's see. How do I sound? How do I sound? Oh, I sound fine. Lovely. Let's get started then. Oh, yes, baby. Feels good. Okay. So I know that this part runs. I know... I know the game launches. I was able to go into settings. Um... I think we just start the game and then we just tweak stuff as we go. This first round. I don't even... Gosh, I don't even know what class I want to play yet. I don't even know what class I want to play yet. Ooh. Is that Latin? Conviction is the human will that reaches its greatest potential. Ooh. What a tagline. Little medieval jig. Getting quite rowdy in there, aren't they? <laughs> Look at them. So joyous. So proper. That's a sick throne. Wait a second. And a cool looking knight. What the heck? He looks badass. On a guess. Lend me your ears. Okay. Long as our Febramon suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Queen without a king? Decades have passed since last his majesty Erland sat atop the dragon throne. Is that the guy from the first Long. game? Forget all their Have names. Forget all their names. It has not been for naught. I'll shut up. I'll shut up. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. Okay. The return of the sovereign. <laughs> Are we completing the cycle again? Inspiring the sovereign. Your Majesty shall have my eternal fealty. No Your Majesty, of how long I have awaited this moment. Are these all key players, or are these just random peeps? I actually don't know with this game. I can't there's so much imagery like that feeds into this itself what the heck on that throne especially behold before you sit the rightful inheritor of the dragon throne chosen by the dragon as its enemy. oh okay we are the arisen okay behold a rejoice fortune has delivered us our savior at last at last praise be for only the sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the sovereign! All hail! Let all present pledge their allegiance to the sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our allegiance reign when they are end. Long live the sovereign of Vermont! Long live the sovereign! Oh. The reason. Thou who wouldst slay the dragon. Okay, we get cool blood visions. If thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life. Does he steal my heart? Isn't that what the dragon does? I ask thee to demonstrate thy will. For naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate. Oh. So he asked us to give our heart and our life. 
to dedicate it to change our fate? Question mark? Wow. It's a big call. The big ask. It's a cool rod. What the frick? I want that staff. Oh! Now, which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. You can select a prisoner to use as a preset or select the hooded person. Customize your character from a blank slate. Ooh, look at us. We're going to make our character. Do I want to take a preset? I think that so the point what I do when I look at presets on characters is I try to extrapolate character traits out of them, I guess, and then use that as fuel for uh, decisions you make in game, right? It's a role playing game. It's a role playing game. You got to play your role. But I do like making my own. So I think we're just going to go raw custom. I don't see any of these bases that I like too much. His face I can see a little out of. Could work with that. Could work with I that. The one, then. Oh, I forgot they had Leonins now. They got Lion Race. Oh, that's so cool. I don't want to be a Leonin. Unfortunately. This time. Do I want to be one though? When's the next time I'm going to be a Leonin? With lines, you get what? You get loyalty, you get power, you get strength. Oh, man. Ah, it must be you. You've got an arrogant look about you. You just called me arrogant because he taunted me. Uh -huh. I think I have to I pick him I now. Recognized you. Frick, I got, I got baited into making my own character. Gosh dang it. She's raised body type, base head will determine the character's basic appearance. We'll be able to make further edits by selecting customized. Ooh, once finalized, the Arisen's race cannot be changed. Okay. Oh, because that's, yeah, just human or Leonin. Human. Base, but yo. We can go oh, we can go big tall boy. We can go tall lanky boy. We can go bulky boy. We can go bottom heavy boy, standard boy, slightly smaller boy, slightly smaller, less confident posed boy, aka the shoulders drop a little bit. Stocky lad, generic JRPG character. Who do we want to pull out for this lad? Let me, you know what, real quick before we. Even, this is big because I want I want my character to reinforce. I want to make him cool. I want a cool guy. I don't want him to reinforce his beliefs and his appearance. Because that's how you make a fun character. I need to look up their classes first, though, to see what kind of story we're telling. Dragons, dogma, two classes. List. I need I need a list. Do I go to IGN? I guess I go to IGN. You got it. Uh fighter archer thief mage which then can go into warrior or sorcerer or hybrid vocations of magic archer mystic spear hand trickster and wayfarer ew wait those actually sound sick what is wayfarer that sounds fun to me wayfarer and trickster or sorry way all the hybrid vocations sounded really cool we're probably going to do a hybrid vocation Wayfarer is super versatile. Capable of switching vocations on the fly. Ooh, and weapons. Along for incredible skill combination. So super high sk skill ceiling is what Wayfarer is. Wayfarer could be casting massive spells or firing a volley of elemental arrows. The next that could be unleashing a charged powerful melee attack with a mighty great sword. Okay. But Wayfarer sounds kind of rad, but also like a lot of thinking. Let me see Mythic Spear Hand. They use a duo spear, twin edge spear that can be slashed and thrusted. Okay. 
Mythic Spearhand uses magic to bind enemies and then quickly close in on their target. That sounds freaking so cool. I want Mythic Spearhand. That's just Dragoon. Mythic Spearhand is just a Dragoon. We're making a freaking dope Arisen Dragoon. Okay. That sounds dope. Oh, the Trickster looks so cool too, though. Wait a second. They use a sensor. What game uses a sensor as a weapon? Those are so cool. Those are the little, the little, uh, uh, what's it called? Oh, frick. What do you put them? You put like incense in them, um, but you're using that as a weapon and you're spinning it around on a chain, like a mace or a flail. Oh, that's so cool. Um, no. Okay. So that's more, it's turning foes against each other, which I'm never, I'm never good at that, but maybe that's why I should do it because it'll train me and then mythic archers just, that's cool. No, I want to do mythic Spearhand. That one, that one sounds the most cool. So mythic Spearhand looks to be. A combo between red and blue. Which I believe then is just warrior and mage. Dude, wait, warrior just looks dope. Okay, okay. So I guess the sidebar is if I'm going mythic spear hand, what do I want my partner to be? I think just a warrior. My pawn. Or do I want him to be cool? No, I want my partner to be a sorcerer. Yeah. I guess we have that choice. <laughs> Ooh, that's tricky. We'll figure out what we want the partner to be later. But I want Mythic Spear. M myth mythic? Mystic? What is it? Let me get the, let me get the, uh, get the words down first. Mystic spear hand. That's what I want. Okay. We'll worry about, worry about the less, less rest later. Now we know. Mage and fighter is what I need to spec into. Mage and fighter. I don't want to be big, big boy. Do I have a classic anime guy? A little tiny anime boy. Let's do this one. A little shorter, but not too short. Still nimble. You know, maybe we even do this guy. Nimble, but not super bulky. Yeah. Light on his feet. He was in his youth, and then he bulked up. That's what we're saying. <laughs> That's what we're saying. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot I was using my... I'm using a controller for this game. All right. Let's find a cool look for you. The long... I feel like he's got to have long flowy hair. Long flowy hair for a... Oh, this is just base heads. We'll get. Oh, can you pause to customize? Okay. I debated doing this whole character customization beforehand as well. Dude, you can be old man. What the? Old man. Old man. Old man. Okay, so this is like youngest, and then that's like oldest, I see. That's how they arrange them. I don't want super boyish. This guy looks kind of like... Oh, uh, what's his face? Macaulay Culkin? A little bit? Mixed with like... A De Niro. Or Defoe. Mixed with William Defoe. 
Yeah. Yes. We're going to mess around with it. Too tall. I wish those notches on the side meant anything. Come on. That's probably good. That's probably 169. Ah, funny number. Oh my goodness. We can be all legs. I like how it had the notch of the initial though. Dude, that is such a subtle change. 40 types of musculature. Oh my God. Goodness. Muscle strength. Big strong guy. Flex it a little bit. Fantasy game, baby. It's a fantasy game. He's malnourished. Big bulky boy. Look at the traps up a little bit. I want his torso to be like... I want his chest to be a little smaller. But maybe I just need to adjust other things to get bigger. Not as big. His face is getting customized, don't you worry. Oh, dude. Wait, if we're launching, we got to have some beefy legs. Like, no joke. We can't just be scrawny. We got to have a little... little not like hugely beefy legs though, because we still got to get off the ground. It's that nice muscle mass difference. Oh, there's strength, but I'm not like super weighing it down, you know? Yeah. We'll just go a little below, a little below average. Lower body size. Oh, maybe that's where we, we get the get the strong but thin legs. Yeah, wait, there we go. Okay. Feeling better about that. Oh, wait, so what's that? Lighting? This is in the overworld, how we look. By the beach, how we look. In the desert, how we look. Yeah, I just need to change our face a little bit. And then in the caves, how we look. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now I just need the face. Um, head. Let's do this real quick. How do I zoom in? There we go. Now we got to find our face to mold. We were on 34. No, I did want to start with 34, but I wanted to adjust 34. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're cooking with gas. Now we are cooking with gas. I like that one. I like 15. Base color. We're pretty freaking white. Almost glowing, but not quite. 
Wrinkles way up or way down? We'll take a medium amount of wrinkles. Skin sheen. How slick are we? Oh, <laughs> always glistening, but it's really, we're just really freaking sweaty, man. That is wow. Here, I want a little sheen though. I want it for those. Those dank pictures. A little bit of justice, a little bit of hard work. Ah, wait. With too many buttons. Ooh, lower the brow a bit. I kind of want different eyebrows, low key, high key. He's so sad now. He's like, oh, that softened his gaze so much. Flat eyebrows. Maybe we we'll raise him a little bit. A little more gentle. That's a little more serious. Okay, I like that. Thinking about things a little bit. Okay. I need like I need like lines on his face, man. I still I still need guides when I'm making a face. <laughs> when I'm sculpting. Get some big eyes on him. Oh, we can do a little lazy eye. Wait, that's actually dope. I should also just squint. I'm a squinty guy. I want to squint a little bit. Okay, now we kind of look like Rocky. Maybe don't squint that much. I don't want the eyes closed. What do I want to do with his nose? I want to bring out the bridge a little. It's a little flat. It's a little... Oh, bumps out in the middle too much, I think, for my nose. With this one, I have a I have a freaking big nose, man. I got a large nose. Large and in charge. The bump. Yeah, get the bump down a little bit. Not a lot though, because you still want structure there. You still want structure. I don't want it. You don't want it. You don't want that. Or maybe you do want that. I don't want that. <laughs> I don't like that. Nostril height. A little lower. A little lower. <clears throat> Excuse me. A little something in my throat. Tip. Tip death. Depth. Oh. Hmm. 
Life of P build. Take it out a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Angle though. Nah, we want like right there. That's actually perfect. Sharpness. We a pointed nose? What's my nose like? Feeling my nose looks in mirror. <laughs> Pulls out foam camera. Spins it around. My nose looks nothing like that. Not from straight on, at least. It needs to be narrower, I think. But, like, all of it needs to be narrower, not just the bridge height. Uh, nostril width. Yeah. And then, where's the other width? That's fine. Spend enough time on the nose. Here's. Can't even see him. Dude, give me a little elf ears. I love a little elf ear. I'm about it. Little type three. Maybe I should do my hair first. Yeah, let's do the hair first. I'm finish the rest of the face. Hair is always important to find. What do we got? What do we got? I want something long and flowy. You better believe we're getting a beer too. Oh, that's like the, the guy from freaking Street Fighter. That's Blanca hair. What the heck? Just straight up. Or the guy from Yakuza. Kind of like this, honestly, not going to lie. This with a beard would be kind of lit. Can I get a beard? Yes. Oh, they got the good fan. They got good fantasy beards, baby. Let's go. Oh, I can be sick. Oh, they don't have good stubble, though. Oh, don't crash. No, no. The mustache was too strong. It crashed. It crashed. Oh, it didn't crash. It came back. Crash report tool from Capcom. A game crash report is being created. This report will be necessary when making inquiries, so please hold on to it. I am. You know what? Game just came out. I'm doing my due diligence, baby. It at least it caught itself. Hey, it caught itself. It caught itself. This is what it's supposed to do. I'm trying to be gracious only because I like it. This is my dry bias showing through. Wow, that was a weird noise my throat just made. What the frick? Wow. Refreshing system information. Windows error reporting. Oh, yeah, I'll let this finish. I was just going to alt tab um, and let it go. But gosh, man. I was in the middle of finding a mustache that worked. The heck? Um, taking donos now for me able to get a new computer. So that way this doesn't crash as much. And I can max the frick out of my settings. 
Oh my goodness. I'm liking this so far though. We haven't even played yet. We haven't even played yet. Freaking making a character. What else do I want to add on the character here? Let me not get distracted. Let me focus on the character here. Let me let me use this time to think while this this error report is generating. Oh, nice. I did it. Save location. Why the frick would I? S One sec. Where'd that go? The file saved in like the Steam Apps Commons crash. Okay. Close. Now the game closed. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's go look at this crash log. I'm actually curious. Oh, uh, I need to go to my Steam Apps. This PC uh, program files 86. Steam. This is where everyone's Steam is. This isn't me leaking anything. Don't worry. Now you know where yours is. If you're on a Windows computer. Steam apps, I believe. Common. Yes. And then we've got... Dragon's Dogma 2. Crash reports. Very top. They make you a file and they zip one for you. Oh yeah, it is just, that is. Hey, it's actually not bad. So what did, what they did, this is if you're in a QA or anything like that. I used to be in QA, so this stuff kind of intrigues me. Um, It looks like it's just a log with giving a time. If it's in a directory, the memory usage question mark. And then the file that was doing the thing. That's just timestamps. Which makes sense because then that's how you debug. Because then you go into that file and you look at whatever the programmer put question mark. Yeah. Oh, and then a whole bunch of my computer information, system information. Which makes sense. Because... We're on PC and there's so many, there's so many different PC parts. And they're like, what if it's just a problem with the part? It works with this part. It works with that part. Yeah. Huh. Cool. Uh, let's get back in. You. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, this game starts in small. It starts small. Like, what is that? I think it was 2080 by 800 instead of 1920 by 1080. Ooh. Capcom presents the Marvel Comments. God, I'm so bad at fighting games. <laughs> Why can't I be good at fighting games, man? Dish man. Just want to be good at the game and play with friends. Starts game. We're skipping the cutscene. We already saw the cutscene. Holds A to skip. Excavation site, Gaul. Which is just, is it? Okay, I always want to say it's Gaelic for jail, but it's it's just a, it's just jail. I don't know if it's Gaelic. Let me look up the origins of that real quick. Because they use that in uh, Elden Ring as well. Yes, yeah, so it just means jail in the Oxford language. This is the British spelling of jail. We can. Now, which one of you was it? Britaboos. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Oh, now I gotta I do it all over forward. again, man. No. Uh -huh. I thought oh, I oh you. my nose work. <laughs> oh, my 
my nose work. We can speed run it. Who did I use? I used you. I used you. Oh, we can segment it a little more. I see. So this is going to distill it and then we customize it. Should have done this in order last time. Something like that's not bad because, okay, treat this as like my hair is pulled back because we're customizing the face. Yo, this guy's kind of got a stare like slime. Or maybe we looked like this. No, I want the long hair. And then we section that out a bit. Yes. <sighs> okay, here we go again, chat. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Why is there no, why, why can't I save while I do this, man? Why can't I save while I do this? Also, 62 weight a lot. Is that in kilos? I don't know kilos. Funny number? What well, muscle type? It was like, we went around the horn. 36 looks right. We went way up on the muscular, musculature. We went... Lower the traps a little bit. Not too much, though. Slight gain in upper body mass. Slight gain in... Oh, no. Big gain in lower body mass. Big gain in lower body muscle mass. Reduction in size. Because we're freaking a dragoon. We're about to launch people, baby. Gotta have thick legs if you want to jump to reach the heavens. Cool. Confirm. Back. Head. Big head mode. <laughs> Tiny head mode. Gotta get his full body in perspective for this, you know? That's too small. That's too big. His head's... It's the right size. Maybe he's got a little too big of a head, but you gotta be if you wanna be a dragoon. You know, you gotta have a little big head. A little bit of a big head, not a little big head. Definitely not messing with the height. You know, actually, maybe a little taller. I have a long head. Keep it like that. Head depth. Very short. You gotta like move it and you gotta let it settle a bit. I think that depth looks better. Yeah. Face height. Okay. Neck length. Ooh. Taller boy. Give him a long neck. Yeah. 70th, 70th percentile of a neck. And then a skinny neck. Makes it look a little longer. 
Okay. Upper body now. Oh, there we go. Widen the shoulders a bit. That's actually good. Oh, built-in pauldrons. Let's go. No, we're not doing. We're not freaking doing that. That's too thick. Chest thickness. This is. Okay, this is forward. Holy. No, we'll just do a little more. <laughs> just a little more. Chest size. Swinging a spear. It's probably a little over. I mean, that kind of makes sense. I'm trying to think of the weapon we're going to be using and how it's going to affect our body. Torso width. Oh, that's width. Not super skinny, but we want to be thinner because we want to keep the frame slightly lighter. This body is our Eva. This is our mech. Longer arms, bigger reach. Advantage on the field. I like that. Yeah, man. <laughs> okay. Lower body. Smaller waist. Slims it down. Rear size. Glutes, baby. We got the glutes. I think the leg size then is fine. Thigh size. <laughs> so it's such big thighs. Smaller thighs and calf size. Gotta get that launch. Gotta get that launch. It's a freaking rabbit. Those looks are, those looks are way too big, Max. That will do that. Just we're like, whoa, that's I guess we got calves. What the heck? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. There we go. We need to fix the hair so much. I do not like that hair in him and, and the rest of his, the minute details of his face we need to do. With the body, other than that, I'm feeling pretty good. Ooh, wait a second. Basic stride. A little bit of sway in the arms. A little bit of, okay, I like the... Classic swagger. Okay, elbow. Dude, we can begin to adjust how we walk. What the heck? This is actually so cool. Macho man. It's, it's just macho man. And then... Just a little stroll. We do want to have the arms flared a little bit. Oh, that, that's just that's just straight the macho man walk with the frick he did this do a little less posture here we go yeah there you go <laughs> look at him oh look at him go No, we don't want that. God, you can make some funny characters in this. What the heck? Uh, 
That's so good. Okay. Now we're on the face. <laughs> now we're on the face. Last time it freaked out in the mustache, so... We got our base head, skin, already did our skin. We wanted our little sheen. We wanted to glisten in the sun. Low wrinkles were young. Eyebrows down a bit. Eyebrows a little closer together. I want to swap my eyebrows. How do I, where's... Raised up, softened, softened. Outer depth goes down for sure. Okay, I feel like it's his eyes are just too in his skull right now or his forehead pops out too much just a bit it's got that nice shade though eyes here we go eye depth A little bigger. We gotta get the overall field too. You need the close up, but then also the uh, the far away. Little squint. Little squint. Just how you look. Too close. Let's go like there. Oh, the nose. We're back to the nose. A little longer. Skinny up. Oh, there we go. Drop both of those straight shot. Need to widen that a little bit. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Nostril size. A little bigger. Nostril height. A little lower. There we go. That gives a little more shape. little wider drop the sharpness ooh not that much i need the bump i need this lower bump up there we go And then this a bit less. That's pretty good. Looks like my nose. No, it did it again.
I hit confirm. I hit confirm. I hit confirm. I hit A. I hit A to confirm it. I didn't need to. I could have just hit B. Guys. What is this? I just I just want to make my cool mythic stabby guy. Come on, man. Oh. <laughs> I just want to get out of the goal. The gulag. Gosh, I gotta stand up and walk around. I'll be back when this is freaking crashed. actually back in a second it did finish though you know what I, I will be actually back let me get this moving while I get more snacks I need more water and stuff <laughs> I just want it to work man oh, I just want it to work I just, I just want to play fun fantasy game man I just want to play fun fantasy Almost done, sorry.
gonna get really good at making characters. I'm gonna get really good at making characters in this game. If it keeps crashing like this. Oh, I took off my hat too. So I just showered. So I was keeping my hair down. Otherwise it just looks like a mess. Like I can't see out of my There we go. Oh my gosh. Alright, I heated up a cheeseburger. Hmm. Alright. It kind of tastes like when you'd get it like a It's even like fairground cheeseburger vibes. You know, you know what I'm talking about. It tastes like a little not real. That's probably because it was microwaved. Oh, and I have a, a prebiotic grape soda. The frick? Actually, not bad. I like grape sodas. Skip. Holds A. Now, which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on. It's me. Step forward. The one without a name or a face. Aha. Uh -huh. I thought I recognized It's me. You. This one. The edgelord in the background. Small body, but not the smallest. Uh, uh. Takes. Um. I like those eyebrows more. It's a better starting point. We may do these eyebrows. I like the scar too. I think I like that facial hair better. Okay, we're doing you and then we're shaving you. Yes. Yes. Thirty something. Way up. Way down. Muscle mass up. Way up. Way down. Skinny boy. Back. No, wait. This is where I was. Okay. Who? Who? That's almost bad. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I thought I could save. Frick. I should have been keeping track of all these. Oh my gosh, they have numbers next to them. One. Sixty-two looks fine. Width looks fine. I want my depth more. Oh wait, I was gonna swap my hair. Shave my head real quick. Some of all the clippers. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. One, it's less things for the game to load. Less chances for a bug. Two, I can see the face better. It's a win-win. Yeah, I wanted a little more depth to the skull. 
round, but not too round, you know? A little lanky in your neck, but not too lanky. Let me thin it out, because that makes it look a little more lanky. A little wider shoulders, not too much wider, just a little bit. A little extra increase in shoulder size, still below half though. Chest thickness. We can, yeah, we can approach that a little bit. I want the collar line to look like, look, okay. Look at the neck and the collarbone. I gotta work on that. We gotta go back to neck. Uh, like that gap is, that is, it's too big of a gap. Got to look, look at all the shapes. There's too many shapes. Holy frick. I've been working on um, negative space recently. Going around with that. It's been opening my eyes up to a lot of different shapes that I've been missing. Which is pretty fun. Hmm. Huh. I was about to spill ketchup all over myself. Burger's still good. I just took like four big bites. Holy frick, I gotta pace myself. It's fine. That just looks weird. Is that how my neck... I need to study that on my neck. Maybe it's my traps that are too big right here. They're too small? No, they're... Like, that's no shot. In the back, that makes more sense, I guess. It's just that that little bit between... The traps and the the neck and the collarbone. It needs more meat there. But it's fine. Pans out. Okay. Um lower body. Excuse me, up. I gotta punch out my thighs. That's right. And my calves. That's right. Yeah. Get the gate right. We'll do a little plump waist size. We just smaller last time. little pump to the thighs, a little pump to the calves. But overall, we keep on below. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, I forgot we had our, our movement. I think we're like right there. little of that I want a little more goof yeah a little more swagger a little more saunter I want I want him leaking confidence a true hero's hero a true people's hero Or so he thinks. Base skin. I gotta lighten it up. <clears throat> we did four. Little sheen. Brow. Is there no just brow type? Eyebrows. Oh, I love the slash through actually. 
I want to do a slash through in real life, but I feel like I'll be made fun of for it. I mean, like, I think this is, that's probably the closest to the type of eyebrows I have, question mark. Yeah, because I have that slant down. Um, we'll keep them dark. Have a dark brown, very dark brown, like uber dark brown. Looks into all the. Ooh, this one's pretty. I need darker than that though. Sure. Yeah, big thick, like right there. I need darker. I need a more brown brown. But still almost black. It's actually not bad. Ooh, like, yeah, like right there. Okay, that helps with the eyebrows. Now I need skin. Brow, actual brow, okay. Raise them up a little bit. Bring them a little closer. Angle them a little softer. Space them out a bit more. It's amazing how much the brow changes someone's face. That's nuts. Like that just completely changed his demeanor. Higher eyes. A little wider apart. I love making characters. This is so fun. Holy cow. I'm, I'm having a blast. Like I'm actually, I'm actually having so much fun right now. Just making a character. Oh my goodness. I guess we should save. Nice. Wait, they're about at the squint. Yeah, the good squint number. Let's go. Okay. Back on the nose. This is the one I wish I had all the numbers for. I should just be print screening all these. Not as pointy. Maybe not as angled down. Yeah. Then a little point here. A little more angled down. Okay. Ears. Do let's do type seven. Ears look okay. When you look just at ears, ears always look so funny. I think I just need to fan them back a little bit. Size them a bit down. Oh, they can be angled up. No, we want them flat. Flat-ish. Openness. Oh, I guess that makes sense. If your ears are pointed forward, you're going to hear a lot more forward. But ears are supposed to be a little bit pointed to the side. 
to take in your oh wait that makes so much more sense for years this man felt inclined to go to the skies because he could always hear things from the top a little easier so he wanted to cover his defenses oh my god and then just lo lobes he's got lobes That's pretty good. Cheeks. Lower out the bottom. Okay, he went. No cheeks. Cheek bulge. Neck fat. Cheek width. You can have some big cheeks. I have some big cheeks. Cheek depth. I'm not seeing this change anything. Oh, now I am. Yes. Yes. Mouth. Smaller mouth. Thickness. Ooh, so kissable. <laughs> Okay. Jaw and chin. Super defined or not very defined? Let's go with a not very defined. Slim it in. We'll do a little less than all the way. It really lowers that jaw. Raise it up a bit. Protrusion. I think where it's at was fine. Chin height. Chin width. Also looks pretty good. Sharpness. No, I don't like it that sharp. I like to where it was. Okay. Um, what did I not do on him? I didn't do I color. That's later. Here we go. I have lovely little hazel eyes. So one I like two. Wait. That's really close to what I have. <laughs> Just got to find the right brown for in there. Yeah, okay, I like that. Um, there's tertiary color. Oh, yo, they like eyes at this place in the cool way.
That's like lizardy. So I can go way more green in my green, and then I can go way more brown in my interior. And then tone it down, probably. And then tone it down. I'm not blue. Uh, this is too vibrant of a green. I mean, I need a muddier green. I need a browner green, not a blue green. As I look through the blue greens. Um, that one's not bad. It's a little too muddy, though. Well, that kind of works. So I go, if I go a lighter green in the middle, though. I've never been able to do my eye color this well. That's too bright. 66 is too bright. I feel like 60 is pretty good. Yeah, I like that. Nice. Freaking beyond the black rainbow eyes. If you get that movie reference, you're cool. You're ahead of the curve. Okay. Eyelashes. I have long lashes, man. Honestly, I have lashes like that. It's my lower lids is always, always less. Always a little less. No, no. Why? Why? Why did it crash again? <laughs> uh, I can only be sad so many more times. Well, at least I can take up my plate now. He says looking for some form of positivity. Uh, I'll be right back. It's doing error reporting. Dude, I'm just about to go play Cyberpunk again. Which is a funny thing to say when the game keeps crashing over and over. <laughs> oh, Cyberpunk's so fun. It's the other game I've been playing, alright? I want to play this game so bad, though. I want to be a little fantasy dork. I give up. You know what? I give up. I'm going to try it off. I'll try it off stream. I'll do it off stream. I'll record it, but I'll do it off stream making my character and then we'll, we'll pop it up. We're playing freaking cyberpunk. 
because cyberpunk runs and i want to play a game i spent an hour 20 minutes trying and i don't got all the time in the world yeah, be more patient you like this game i do like this game but my patience is through i want to have fun Cyberpunk 2077 End game Or Act 3 Shenanigans Act 3 RP I like that That's a vibe I can get behind Freaking Dragon's Dogma 2 crashing on I'm so excited to play the game <laughs> Dude you can't play the game you want to play It hurts my soul it hurts my soul. Oh, maybe because I was capturing in two places that actually probably wasn't helping. What is maps.exe and why is it running? What is pickerhost.exe and why is it running? Let maps access your precise location. What? What? What is on my computer? Um, searches by name. Good morning, Night City. Yesterday's body count lottery rounded out to a solid. I found them. <laughs> it was just the generic maps per <laughs> program. Well. Cyberpunk time. I played a little bit off stream. The goal also, by the way, the goal for Cyberpunk was to beat it today. I don't want to reconnect my controller. I unplugged it for a reason. I play this game with mouse and keyboard. Because it feels right now. I'm figuring things out. I'm, I'm feeling real good in this game. Oh my God. Oh yeah. I just uh, took out that guy. The fuck you mean backing out? All of them? <laughs> Ooh, he just lost all his sponsors. Um, but we have respect. I did some Johnny missions, so we are now. I guess we're only 30% Johnny. We're now just we're samurai. We're we're a cool guy. Look at the look at the fit. Look at the fit. Oh. It feels good. We're a ninja. Um, I'm about to go respect my cyberware, actually. We're going to... I bought some Mantis Blades, or we're going to go put those on. <laughs> I needed I needed the gloves or the Gorilla Gauntlets, though, specifically for um, this fight. I played it horribly, by the way. I'm glad I wasn't streaming it. I'm glad I wasn't streaming it. Ooh, this is hella spooky, hella nice. Taking donations to get a better PC so that way I can see this in higher resolution and with more fun things going on. God, this game is pretty. Like that right there. Turn off the HUD. Or maybe even just increase the HUD's opacity so it's more cyberpunky. Put in some lines, some like VHS lines. And then some rain and some nice. The music in the background right now, honestly, is perfect. It'd be lovely. Oh, you know what I did figure out? I should do this. I forgot about this. Because we're playing Cyberpunk, I can put on my Cyberpunk music. Um, Check what I got for the stream. I guess we'll start with this. This is, this is going to blow your minds away. I found a, I found a way to get the... Uh, to get music. 
uh, figured or showing what song we're playing on Spotify on stream. Which I've been wanting to do since I started streaming. So this was like big. This was a big discovery for dry. Big discovery for dry. You see it? Do you see it? You don't hear it right now, but. Okay, we're, first of all, I don't know what I'm listening to right now. Whatever, whenever by TNG. See, but now people don't have to ask what music you're listening to. It's just, it's just playing. It's freaking sick. Um, so on YouTube, it's not going to be playing. Sorry, YouTube. But on Twitch, I can do whatever I want. Hooray. Now I need to have my Spotify somewhere on my Twitch. Okay, I mean, Hanako at Embers? No. Um, I need to see if this is running at a proper frame rate on stream. Give me a second, or this is hella slow and jittery. That I did not test. One second. Okay. I have me down there. I think it's fine. Can you tell I wasn't looking at the road when I was driving? Drives. Oops, sorry. Someone in this? Oh yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Okay. Feels better. My, my OBS, it was lagging a little bit, but it makes sense why the OBS is lagging. I'd rather the OBS lag than you guys lag. Who we got? Four, five nerds. Who are these guys? Just scavengers? Oh, frick them. They're they're donezo, mate. They're donezo. Hit them with a little bit of a contagion. Hit with a sonic shock, actually. Freaking assassination. Assassination. <laughs> and there you have it. We're an assassin now. Figuring out that uh, all these were just practice. <laughs> just practice for the story missions. Oh my gosh. Big game changer. Where's my... Ooh, nice. Turns off radio. Judy. Judy. What up? So, you got a plan? Damn right. Where's I do. the red thing? Come over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with oh us. yeah. We're raiding My embers. Be here too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? A and A. Artichokes and avocado flavor. Gross. Zucchini for good measure. Cool, fancy. So, I'll see you come evening. Did you hear? 
Of course I'll be there. You just gotta be yourself. You just gotta have the confidence to ask for what you want. Like avocados and anchovies, apparently. Then you're a cool guy like V. The frick. I can see avocado being good on pizza. I guess the saltiness from the anchovy as well. There's a lot of flavor packed in there. But I don't... The fishy flavor is what gets me. There it is. That's what I wanted. Looking for the red X on the map. Give me the tier 5 component. Uh, we need to go talk to... Okay, so with Judy, we're doing a raid on... Uh, cloud... The cloud... Uh, what's it called? Prostitution place. We're going to raid that and take it down as a kind of catharsis. Help out Judy thing. Slash also, they did not treat Evie well. So makes sense why we'd want to do that. Um, but I also want, yeah, we can call, yeah, yeah, we can call and ask a real guy. That'll be fun. I want to do that. Um, that'll be a blast. Also violence. We got to talk to Lizzie Wizzy real quick. Let's get the gig from Lizzie because that'll take us back in town, get us close to our ripper and then we can take out our gauntlets so we can get in our mantis blades. Easy. I get down to business, go hang out with Rogue for a little bit. We're channeling Johnny, and then we'll do the job with Judy while it's channeling our Johnny-esque energy that we just learned from Rogue. Boom. Boom. How is this in the vibe? Oh man. A foggy night city. I've never seen the fog in this game yet. It's so good. <laughs> Dang it, I thought I was gonna be I thought I was gonna be cool with it. Oh they make them cars sturdy in Night City. Oh, we wanna go up this way. I think. Yeah, we do. Ready, ready? It's so hard to see in first person. Uh, so good. All righty, Lizzie, what you got for us? Huh? Use you? Uh. Hello? Takes a second to reload, okay little distraction I'm not good at fighting in cars Bryce has a little extra dosh for us leave our car there I'm 
got the max movement. Also, I can't see chat like this. There we go. All righty. Lizzie, Lizzie, Lizzie. What info did you drop? When we last talked to Lizzie, she gave us the quest to go check out on her manager, AKA her lover. Oh, to see what was up. See if he was cheating on her or not. Uh, we don't think he was. We think he was making a Ingrin copy of her. So now we got to figure out what we got to tell her. Lizzie, what in the fuck? Now I get the rush. Oh. V, I. This is Liam. I, I, I was angry. I, I, I pushed him. These fucking arms. These hands. Oh my god. She killed him. You ever wake up in the middle of the night and not know who you were for a second? Shit. Or in shreds. You ever feel like you weren't really you? I. That's how I feel all the time. Every moment, this emptiness, this helplessness, I stopped seeing, creating. Well, what's done is done. You Feel strangled it? him, Lizzie. Slowly. You crushed his spine. I... I was angry. I must have lost control. Ooh. So, this is about the body, right? Cyber psychosis question mark? Yes, I the media can't hear about this. Got it? That would be Ooh. Huh? Yeah, what are you thinking? The world would eat it up. A tale of the temptation to control another's memory. A grim reminder that a person is merely a Now she's thinking like an artist. Copied, reproduced, copied, reproduced. Lizzie snapped the fuck out of it. What about the body? I don't know. Do whatever. Take it somewhere. Burn it. I'll pay you. Okay, I'll take care of it. Yeah. Now. Listen, V gets his hands dirty. Sleep? I won't sleep. I don't need to. Thank you, Liam. You don't realize it, but you've given me something beautiful. What the hell are you talking about? Go, V. Go. And take him with you. Jeez. Someone should... Someone should give you a checkup. See if you're okay, Lizzie. Someone you trust. Yeah. I like what's happening to me. Lovely to meet you, V. Now go. Go. Someone should still check up on her. It's good that she likes it, but you just want to be sure, you know? Especially after you killed someone. Especially after you killed someone. Dump it. Nice. Violence complete! Okay. Let's go to our Ripper. After I take care of this reported crime. Dang, I can't believe she just murdered someone. Like in cold blood. Who would do something like that? And then just shrug it off? Like, oh frick. Unsent message. Joe, <laughs> it's important. The end is near. Now you can hear their voices, Joe. We can keep turning on the radio. She just seems so normal. Ooh, pulls out knife. 
but I guess even ugh, pop stars are okay with getting their hands a little dirty as well. Bop, 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 bop. Use the fists while I got them, baby. Something ain't right. Oh. Use the fists while I got them. Hyper violence. Hyper violence. I'm worried about you. That's not what you send. That was the wrong choice. We should have fed into her delusion. Oh, we hide amongst the fog, baby. New job from Beat the Brat? Wait a second. Okay, wait, another fight? There's so many tiger claws. I used to this freaking pistol. Okay, with the slow mo, the pistol's hella hype. Wait, that's gonna be really fun. That's gonna be really fun. Okay. That was mostly just to back to the map. Get a little extra dosh, flex the thingies. We're in a transitional period for V. Oh wait, no, that's the right way. Nope, this is the right way. Oh, it's so cool. The fog makes it so cool. Fog makes it so cool. Yo, Vic, what up? Time to swap out some parts. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Oh, you have a look. Hmm, toxic mantis blades. Feels good. Everything else is pretty good. I could upgrade it for free or just buy it. I think I'm just going to buy it. I really don't need to buy any of this right now. I'd rather keep my dosh. I guess there's something cool, some cool weapon I need to buy. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. These are sick. That's a slashback, so then I think Holds a little lunge. C 
is not crouch. Control is crouch. I can do this now too. I can be a little scarab beetle. <laughs> Feels good. Oh, yeah. We can get in there now. Okay. Okay. Where are we going now? I've had my fun. <laughs> Figured out how to use this stuff. Uh, oh, let's give Rogue a call. That's right. V. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking? Or is it you? Johnny. No, it's me. You're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Forgot to tell you, swing by in the evenings. Got other things on my plate right now. Perfect. Communication. It is 7 a.m. Oh. Well, we got we got time to kill, I guess. AKA at the bar, get into the Johnny mentality. <laughs> there we go. Hey, how's it going? How do I talk to you? Oh, I can wait till evening outside. How do I wait? Someone's on popping. That should be popping. I think. I think something's churning behind the scenes. One second. Yeah, here we go. What up, nerd? We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna vibe together. I'm gonna sit on your lap real quick. <laughs> I wanna go to the bar and get a drink. Some crew taking you along as bait? <laughs> that a compliment? You look different. <sighs> Try again. Maybe you'll hey, find Rogue. some charm third time Ready? around. Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? You look... Wow. Hyper up. That Johnny's wow or yours? When's he gonna show? She loves it. She loves it. I'm just your driver. See so you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. Yeah, she, she likes us. She likes us. We're in. We're in. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Dragons Dragons get in. went out of style a century ago. Yeah. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a date. Thought so too. Which is why I suggest the classic drive-in. A million years ago so it wasn't his idea of course not his idea of a romantic night out was blowing up our Osaka HQ fair valid understandable I get it
I love the the movie theater. I love right, the drive-in. Such good memories me there. What's going on? For real. Meaning. Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. Right. Track down stretch. That was a good song. Rogue? What's this Just one? taking it all in. <laughs> Run away. A selfless Johnny Silverhand. TDJ. Apparently you're a positive influence on him. And another person I couldn't read fast enough. Oh, this is a good song too. Oh, it's got the bed squeak in it. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. Ooh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Lost focus, little, little spin out. It is so hard to get a cool driving with a mouse and keyboard cinematic driving I should say it's just not as smooth as I'd want it I gotta get more comfortable with a mouse and keyboard here we are more focused on them closed really has We've been, been here while, actually technically it's open been here before yeah and no way in practically have the place all to ourselves okay hey johnny getting hyped getting ready a little privacy try and get the projector started i'll get us some seats sure thing Locked privacy. Exactly where I was supposed to take her 50 odd years ago. Right, let's go check the projector. Entrance is over here. Yeah, this will be nice. Okay, get some hair wax. Like the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and running. Bushido X, Fate to Black. To see. My tech is 20. I know Look how to do that. this. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive in. Movie's the last thing we care about. True. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido <laughs> will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. Have fun, you crazy kids. Oh, Johnny, what are you getting into? Ah, let's see. Grabbed us the best spot. Hop on up. Yeah. I thought I cut out. Starts watching. Looks over. Looks back. This is how you imagine this evening going. Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? That's next year. We just met. And I got no idea what a bastard you are. Sure. Sure. Lured you to the movies so we could bang, by the way. <laughs> 2015. It's technically a possibility, you know. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. It's all jokes. Okay. So it's 2015. If you could do it all again, 
What would you change? Anything at all? Oh, that's the... Oh! That's the line. That's the line. Do anything not to lose you. Oh! That is a Johnny line. He would... Hmm. Taking a while to mull that He is thinking a while to mull this one over. Um... We're still, we're still, listen, we're still caught up on it. I get smashed. We're being honest with her. He got me. And maybe plan more charges in that tower. So you do the exact same thing, just better. Hey, 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 what's this? He's got to learn. Nothing. Teach him, Rogue. Teach him. I had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. I think he might be hiding something from me. Johnny, there's a heap of things I'm hiding from you. Goes both ways. Not a healthy relationship. Oh no. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Oh. Johnny. Remember, it's not the it's Johnny. Rogue. I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here. Oh, he went in for the cheek kiss. Wow. That's see, that's oh, that's gentlemanly like. That's general gen, gentlemanly like. Dude, with the the German Euro base in the background too. Oh my gosh, it's so cyberpunk. It's so cyberpunk. She took her jacket off. Scandal. Hey, yo. Rated M for mature. Do you think that's what the game readers just say in their head every time they find an M rated spot in a game? They just stamp it rated M for mature. I guess you'd only need to see it once to stamp it, right? Remember, this isn't V, this is Johnny. There's a difference. V is still married to the idea of being an edge runner. Johnny, I can't. It's not right. She can't commit. Hey, fair enough. We got to stop them. I get it. I understand. There's a no, lot going on. You don't. I mean, Tried not specifically, so but to pretend nothing's changed, to pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Oh. I actually managed to fool myself for a little. Wait, she fooled me. Get back on my own. Rogue. <sighs> Fuck. It's okay to have good things, rogue. It's okay. Dang, Johnny, shut down. This is also a good song. Well, Rogue's gone. Yep. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. It was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Mm-hmm. Could be something to that. Gotta mull it over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Hmm. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. <laughs> Piss off, radio. You know what, actually? There we go. Give me the bike. 
I need my bike. Give me Jackie's bike. And I got to pee. Let me go pee real quick. Look at this cool scene. B or B. I got to pee. Okay. Did that? It did. Nice. Glitched. Glitched. It's supposed to have a little drop down like that, but it's glitched. <laughs> Dang, that looks fun. Nice. Oh, this feels so much better. This feels so much better. I'm sick. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carrie got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where do you hear anything about Carrie? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. You're bringing yeah. that out. Yeah. So what? Want to pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. So I got to hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person. Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. Well, okay. But I'm trying to figure out how to approach this. Yeah. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. Okay. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V-Care was always dealing with personal shit. 
That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. That's deep. The <laughs> He's always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything, we always got along. Oh! That's one of those lines when it hits close to home, you're like, Frick, man. Why'd that one hit close to home? <laughs> It's almost like people write good characters because they're relatable to all humans and things we go through. Oh no. Oh no. People know my emotions because they feel them too. So scary. <laughs> Big mansion though. He took the samurai, the way of the samurai, to a different destination, it seems. Let's try calling him. Gary Uridine residence, please wait while I connect. What? You'll never guess who. Come back later, maybe. You hate it? Well, Come on. hey, We're lucky the dogs same. Even I get you, Celestial. <laughs> it's a good way to process, though, right? It's a good way to, to feel through it. Do it through freaking Johnny Silver. <laughs> no, never mind. Dude, I'm a lurker at heart, too. I'm a lurker at heart. That's the reason I'm live. To entertain. This is a freaking nice driveway. Okay, also, I just realized he's got he's got guards. Actually makes sense. Good for him. He's got security bots. Good security bots. Does he just... One second. Reboot optics is traceable. I think I want Sonic Shock. Not enough to kill in a one shot, but I don't think we need to. Fugly is seafood. Bus. Nice. Stealth it was expensive, at least. Something's got to justify this level of tacky. All right, if I was a former movie star, director, hyper rich, former friend of a terrorist who wanted oh, fuck. to self loathe, cut crap straight from a cat because I have it all, where would I go? This. Always ate out, always. Dude, never cooked. Never learned that culinary skill. Never went through the culinary challenge. Oh, he's a—he's just like he's in the same boat as Lizzie Wizzy, I imagine. Just can't find that creative drive. And as an artist, man, that is—that is a feeling worse than death. I'm sure. Oh, and he's dealing with the loss of. Johnny, who was the samurai, who was his main influence. Oh no, this means, yeah, he just needs to reconnect with Johnny. That's literally it. He's bummed his best friend's gone and doesn't know he's back and taking it hard at this stage in his life. Dang. Hey, yep, hey, man. That's a good way to put it. Yeah. Blank paper, full of possibilities, but also full, full of possibilities. Where do you start? I feel like decision paralysis is a good sign of our, a good, tra not a, not a good trait, but a good 
descriptor of a lot of the fears of our generation Probably or current era. Necessity in this whole path. There's so many things to pick out. So many paths of life to go down. Ooh, an overture? Too much freedom. <laughs> That's one way to say it. One way to say it. Or not enough respect for freedom. That's another way to say it. This is cool. You just got to learn how to tame it. Control your own little universe of freedom, you know? That's all anyone else is doing. All right. I'll give him that one. That's a, that's a nice looking car. That is a nice looking car. A little gaudy, but in the cyberpunk universe, it's a nice looking car. Where'd he go? I did see that door that goes up higher, I think. Turn off the music, maybe that'll startle him. Um, so I can't go through that door. He's not over here. Yes. Wait, Celestial, I feel that so much. I've, I've recently been coming to that conclusion. Yes. Characters. Yeah, you don't force a character into a situation. Um, you see how they react to it. Exactly. Exactly. Or you do force them into the situation. But you don't force the outcome. Yeah, you don't force the outcome. He is in this house, I think. It says find carry in the villa. Oh, here we go. Wait. What? Oh, I can put in the song. I was like, um, never fade away. That's a good fade one. Away. Cause he's not dead. Guess if I had a fave, it'd be that one. Oh, I thought I was putting that. I thought, I thought I was putting that one on. Okay. <laughs> Even I know that one. An oldie, but a goodie. What's second conflict. I like this going through carried always going through music of a previous generation I guess okay guess so this changed. I like what you said there celestial so what, what I do for my creative process is I like playing I get the creative flow from seeing other people's creative flows um so like in this I take Keanu Reeves his whole atmosphere because that's what this helps draw out because he's Keanu Reeves right and now he's interacting with old music. So then you've got an old character from a generation before looking at old music from a generation before that's clearly drawing themes from like an elder path, you know, like a generation before the past, yada, yada. What's and then as V, the main character, I'm trying to no delve into how like someone that. from a new generation explores old art without ruining it, but also without saying it's the only path forward because that's cyberpunk right that is you're looking at the old rebellion and you're trying to force that hand with a new rebellion or how not force the hand try to figure out how it all blends together into the new rebellion because you're all singing the same thing it's using different words just using different words and that that's how i'm trying to play v that's how i'm trying to play v that's how i try to play me Boom, character. Okay, there we go. We've got more over there. More guitars. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't do that just with this game. You do that with everything. You do that with every movie. You do that with every... Any other game, I guess. That's a, for, for, for role-playing, I guess. That's that's what I do in D&D. &D. That's how you role-play. Character oh, acting, baby. Now I am it's so impressed. fun. Played a few of it's these so myself fun. back in our summer. Especially seeing different mediums um, and how different artists and creators like deal with the tools they're given. Forget it. We couldn't it's all amazing. It. 
That's Karis. Like writers, I guess from your perspective, writers, I'm jealous of the word choice. I wish I could pick words that um, the writers I look at or enjoy pick. It's just, oh, there's such a flow to it, such a confidence. It's lovely. Lovely. In here, red door. Oh, looks like he's showering. There we go. Alone too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. I'm learning how to do that. Do trust me. I'm no god at it. Oh my goodness, I'm so bad at it. <laughs> I also lose focus. It's so easy to lose focus. We just gotta practice. Just gotta try. Or at least that's Drop what I'm telling myself. These special pills. Let's go. Oh man. Okay. Oh man. Back to Johnny. All right. Old school mentality. Old school mentality. Oh, feels so much better. No, oh, this is actually hella smart. Now let's see which are up for show and which are actually strummable. We lost everything. But I gotta. Who the fuck? Keep playing. All right. Play into his game a little bit. Johnny? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. Why am I not focused on him? God, some fucking joke. Come on, camera. Hang on. The bathroom? <laughs> did Silverhand tell me before he died? Thinking a trope or something that people draw on. Ooh, okay. You go for the unsettling tweak. Nice. Hey, that sounds like you got it. Download. You know what to write. That's great. Also, with well, your username, Celestial Cthulhu, I told you're on the you path you want to be on. Pussy. You're on the path you want to be on. Let's go. Oh. That's huge. That's so Johnny funny. Fucking Silverhand. That matches so well. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker. Ooh. Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, also fair. Contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Oh, can you refer to us Cthulhu? Yeah, oh, easy. Yeah. I need a drink. I guess then right. I don't have to second guess Come on. if I say Celeste or Cthulhu. Why do you look like a small time klepto punk from the afterlife? Can do. Oh, frick. He. Wait. This is V. Yeah, give him all the info. You'd like him. The fuck, Johnny? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well. Graffiti apparently. wall would be fun. Fuck. I don't think that's you, intentional. Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Yeah. Shit. With Arasaka. Oh. Mornings I record at their studio. Then evenings Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really? Okay, sign he was messing with? with me. That makes more sense. MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Yup. What a plant. Good to see you. Good to see you. Dude, I feel that though. The I think all artists deal with that. The once you get to the certain point, every one who wants to be an artist, I think, doesn't <laughs> they innately don't want to work for a company, you know? You because you just have that passion, then you're like, frick man. Come on. I gotta sell out a sell little. Tell me where you've been. Or even if you don't time. think it's selling out, you think someone else is going to think it's selling out. Live here all by your lonesome? So it's like you just got you got to pick an evil. Got my cook, Ariel, but you know, he's off today. Miguel. Uh, um, at the moment. Am I? <laughs> it's not, not a creepy your face, but you get a normal smile. Sit at the moment, I am Stop focused. Talking. Um, So I don't know. I don't know if I'm the one to read your story, though. I don't stop writing it, but I don't think I'm the one to read your story. 
Sit the fuck down already. You feel me? You gotta tell your story first. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. Sad is all fuck. You know what? Actually, I do want to hear about a story you have in mind, though. You, I'm, I'm not reading your whole story yet. Yeah, just tell me about it. Tell me about it. Open road actually, yes. Tell me about it. Or cool What's your stream? Yeah, go for a plant. I want to help. I want to help. For sure. All over my life. That was more of me saying it to myself to confirm. <laughs> yes, go for basic plot, Cthulhu. Yes, sorry. I was jumping ahead. I do See, that's what I do. That's my flaw as an artist is I jump ahead to the end. I want to see the end goal. Uh, and I forget all the steps in between. Johnny? Listen, judge for yourself. I might not oh, look at it till after we get this little bit Remember? done, but yes, oh, give me the give me the time, give me your synopsis. Showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Stuff about you being depressed. It's true. Nope. Promo stratagem. Promo Suicide stratagem. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Jeez, that's dark. Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me. Got no answer to that. I feel like a lot of cyberpunks themes. The next wife. The what? Huh. Well, I guess You're the main kidding. theme is why well, I gotta. How long did last? I gotta let this finish for right. Hey, spiel. Too long, but don't worry. I worked out well for her. Gave her my house in Tokyo. Ooh. Cars, kids. Yeah, worked out pretty well for you too, then. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. That'd be freaking sick. Playing fucking rat infested dumps, argued before every gig, had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had Ned do our name. Nancy, control freak. Henry smelled. Yeah, like and I think that's why no one wants to sign. I'm so stealing your pants. It's because you lose this. Hell of good times, man. You lose that grit. You you lose that natural human to touch to your art. And no one wants to lose that because it's it's so hard to keep when someone else is telling you what to do. Fifty four news. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together, you know, jam or something. Oh my gosh, we're we gonna jam or something. The poor little his poor little head. My poor little computer can't keep up with the the lights behind him seamlessly. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do... Closure. Gig. Closure gig. Play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number We're getting the band back I'll together. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not there. Figure it out with V. Sure. Another trope that it's trying to draw things from? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. Pops pill. How am I? Collapses. Johnny. You okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You drift off or what? You two have fun, at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval, I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. 
give me Don't one second through. I'll read that after this section. The hell is this concert thing? So I can give him my full attention. Did you hear that? Get sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. Still gotta try, baby. Yeah, this is different. Carrie needs this. Concert. Yeah, still gotta try. Okay, calling Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice. Oh, beautiful butterfly Carrie emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. Carrie, you're done. Okay. Dark Souls inspired tone wise. Where a boy is given a proxy. Okay, uh, what do you mean by Dark Souls inspired tone wise? Where a boy is given a prophecy saving the world. From being engulfed in darkness and horror. Classic. Okay, so that's where you get Dark Souls tone. You're trying to draw from dark and kind of the horror creepy elements. Understand. Unsettling. He give he goes on a journey to save the world. Classic. We love a hero's journey. Uh in only a few days. Why only a few days? Trying to pull on pressure from I'm thinking theme wise, not so much. Um I don't care why you say this. How do you say this in the nice way? I don't care why you want the things you want in your story. I just think the good stories have a theme that ties them all together you know it's it's all reinforcing ideas like, that's where these questions spur from not to not to knock while you're doing things when so when i say why don't be like oh man he doesn't like it this is i just i want you to extrapolate i want your mind to buzz i think that's how you're gonna write right when your mind's swirling and churning with ideas Ooh. so yeah why a few days uh but at the climax he fails okay only at the end realizing that he was not the savior of the prophecy mentioned. So this, uh, so what you're trying to say then at the end is, or I guess what, the, what that entire story means concludes into is you're not the main character. This is that anti main character syndrome story, right? You're not as cool as you thought you were, but that doesn't mean you shouldn't try. Am I, am I understanding that correctly? Oh no, there's more. There's more. Paying the corridors to prevent people from suffering. Like he has. Okay. 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 So then you come in the second act and then you play as the, this is not play as the main character is the. Yes. Yes. I know where you're going. I know where you're going with this and I like it. Yes. Because the boy... Yeah, so then it's... it's Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's the same thing. Exactly. It's what Cyberpunk talks about. Oh my gosh. Yes, you get it. You get it. It's literally the... So the second gen is... Uh, centuries later, yada, yada, yada. Same prophecy. It's because it's the same thing we're getting told over and over and over again. It's those those threads of history that keep getting like promoted friend of people from suffering like he is wait wait i need to read that middle section again he heads out on a journey and comes across the first boy who is protecting the core of darkness to prevent people from suffering like he has from being tricked oh so that's just straight up dark souls one that's gwyn in the first flame okay the thematically thematically I know you're doing it different don't worry you're not copying you're not copying you're just taking the same themes that's good that's good uh the first boy is yeah yeah so very yeah sounds like you like dark souls which is good um i'm trying to think of other let me yeah i like that that's super fun um i won't give you ideas because i want your ideas to be your own and the only way I feel like I, I know the only way I follow through on ideas is if I make the idea my own. Because I, I have that spurn of originality that I want to keep. Um, but I can help give you ideas to think through. 
I think that is a grand idea, Cthulhu. I think you've got some good thoughts in there. I just think they need refined, you know? Take your whatever it would be, bastard sword, and make it a bastard sword plus 17 or whatever. I can't remember what the max one in Dark Souls is. Is it plus 5? Plus 11? No, you can go up to 10 and then you do a max out thing. That's what you do. Yeah. Yeah. I get what you're saying. I, I, you're preaching to a choir here. I think this is a great thread. Well said, plant. Agreed. Agreed. Yes. Hey, we're on the same page. This is awesome. What the frick? We're on the same page. It's almost like we all play the same games or something. What the frick? <laughs> it's almost like there's a popular media of our time. And we're reading it well. That's so fun. That's so fun. Oh, I love writers. I love writers. Um, Judas apartment in the evening. Beat the bread. Oh, it's called Nancy. Not so bad. It's not so bad. Uh, Nancy? I mean, uh, Bess. Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated <laughs> assistant. Steven, N54 News. How can I help? Want to talk to Bess? She's not here. You know when she'll be back? She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Toad to shoot some stuff. Story on Maelstrom. Yeah, the downside of Twitch is the two minute ad breaks. But hey, to her, puts food on my table. Go Keeps me bed, sane. Nothing's free. That's also part of being an artist. I couldn't even hear that because I was on ads. That's so good. That's so good. That's so classic. Keep the info behind the paywall. Amen. Amen. Welcome back. Yeah, ads are a thing. Cthulhu, what, uh, what medium do you want that story to be set in? Because it sounds like you got a story in your head. And being a writer is such a vast field nowadays. And I love hearing what people are getting creative in. It's so fun. It's so fun. What do I mean? Well, what, uh, is it going to be a book? Is it going to be a comic? Do you want it to be told through, uh, a webtoon, a video game, music, lyrics, opera? What I meant by taking a trope. Possible short story. Okay. Yeah. Because so I feel like that's that's always been my thing. Um. I've always wanted, like, I I know I've got the story in me, but I don't think I'm like the writer, you know. But you have to adopt for for what I want to do in my creative endeavors. I need to adopt the persona of the writer, and I need to understand the writer, so that way I can find the mediums I want to distribute the art. Because I, I love different mediums. Oh my god. I just love creating and producing cool shit. And other people doing that. That is... I don't think we should be gatekeeping people making cool shit. Like, what? A glimpse into the human psyche in an ultra-creative endeavor? When we have the source material to also explain what they were thinking through? Oh my god, that sounds phenomenal. That's what I strive for in an artist community. <laughs> 
Oh, so good. But sick. Yeah, short stories are great. Short stories are dope. I've read some phenomenal short stories in my day. I'm excited to read yours once you get her in. Because that, that sounds like a great synopsis. Oh, I want to take this down so bad. Arasaka. I don't even I don't even get anything from taking him down except for pride. Guess what I'm a sucker for. Be on high alert. I'm whiffed. Sick. That was actually really smart using the using the weapons glitch to make him shoot towards the ceiling so he couldn't shoot at me. Wow, that was actually so easy. I specifically remember passing that street at the very beginning of the game and going, "Ooh, yikes! When when am I gonna get strong enough to take that on? What the frick? They just got a mech right there. Deletes mech. Oh, it feels so good. Deletes mech with skill." that I've purposely chosen. Oh, Maelstorm. We, we destroy Maelstorm. Ready for this one? Oh, there we go. I want the slow-mo. I wanted the slow-mo. <laughs> starting to come together no media would ever go for the taunton tenants except nancy Oof. i'm trying to read that message what the weird Ooh, this place does not look the best. We gotta go upstairs. I think I remember this mission. I think this is Milestorm Nightclub. Which Milestorm represents just people wait. This Milestorm's the tech bros. Tech elitist. Tech elitist. That's Milestorm. I guess. Use that chrome just like that. It's not even tech. It's cyber tech elitist. Oh, start moving. Too? Fuck yeah. Third four. Press the button. It's I changed my body, so I you should change yours. That's Malstorm. Um, what would that be? Toxic growth? I guess. If you're stealing tech and making that be civil advancement. Hear so that? toxic advancement. Tonight yeah. is today. All right, guys. This one I like. Uh, in a flop by dry, do you have a place Later. people can read it? I don't really have a place people can put stories. Besides, like, I need to do that. I'm, I'm trying to rework my, my Discord to be more of a... Just a cool tech environment, like an online forum, as opposed to a gamer streamer Discord. Go on. Because it's You're one more usable in. that no way. Problem. I want it to be a tool for people, you know? I want it to be a place for thoughts to be distilled and written down for support and critique and improvement for everyone. But I haven't figured out exactly how to prep my Discord to be formatted in that way. Um... There's plenty... I would say post it online somewhere. Like, no joke. Find a forum. Find a writer's forum. Just be like, hey, here's my thing. Shoot it out. Worst comes to worst. They say 
hey this isn't good and that just means they're not good enough to critique what you want to write you know Fuck. unless they give an actual good no critique in which case then you just Remember get good feedback for free yeah that's the jumu did royce yeah no 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 wouldn't be that stupid to show up here you the one yeah what anyone actually boohoo when he went we killed these guys as leader a chance at a nick in the barrel get the fuck out now that's the all foods punk. i'm not blind what do you want <laughs> watch out for that one you the one in charge now yeah puzzled never heard tumblr find the twitter sphere for it You'll get your that'd be chance. huge um yeah, I just I just don't know where people write stories online nowadays, unfortunately. But look into that. Google like uh old writing forms from like the two look in stuff for like 2014 to 2018 and then see what that's distilled this into ISIS nowadays. That's the you? best way I know how to find you stuff now. Because no, I look at the old tech talk. and I trace the line to the new you. tech and then I go, that's where that's where it's hot, you know? Gotta talk. That's where things sure. are taking place. I'll take you. And you got to view it as the same way you'd view Too the old stuff you grew up on in the sense of you are now writing to the same people who you're writing to you of the future, you know? And you just got to figure out to be honest, should be how you. many yous are in the future. Getting Royce out of the way was about time. Yeah. Thank you. Well I hope, yeah. Too. I I say because no I, I, I genuinely Anytime. hope that it turns out to all writers, all people like this nowadays. It's so hard. Everyone's got that. That's what this game teaches, man. That's what Cyberpunk teaches is everyone's everyone wants to make it. And holy shit, in this day and age, is it hard to make it? Th but that doesn't mean you don't try. Cyberpunk shows you can you just get you get stylish with it. You know, you be you, you own it and the people around you own it. And then you just vibe. Then you just vibe. Wouldn't mind playing this venue. I really want to take that, but I know if I take it, they're going to get me. We're on a... I already said I... Does that make sense or am I speaking crazy again? Yeah, you said. How about I speak crazy sometimes. <laughs> you tell us who really sent you. The Tinos? Corpo suits? How in the fuck you search her, Tunda? That she still managed to call for help. Oh. That's nuts. Did a number on her. Huh? I didn't call anyone. I don't even know him. But we do. And we won't have history repeating itself. Damn it. Get him. <laughs> Stop. Ooh. Loots the room before oh. checking on Nancy. Thanks. Let's get her out of here. So... Who are you? V. Dude, Carrie I haven't on Reddit in so long. Carrie. Fuck, I do not get this. Uh-uh. Must have spent too much time with paranoid Patty in there. It's about samurai. Talk later, okay? Right. Let's Delta. Follow me. I'll get us out of here. I didn't want her staying alive. Elevator. Over there. Let's go. Ah. All right. Now we got to break Nancy out of the club. I'm focused again, chat. Rick, that has drop. I'm gonna eat your <laughs> Walk to the middle of the dance floor. Headshot. Headshot. Eh. I gotta get the headshots. They're way cooler, chat. Come here. I need to buff my gun. And by buff my gun, I mean... Where the fuck is this dork? Where is he? 
Come here. Oh, he ran. Come here. I missed. You guys didn't. Oh, why do I keep missing? Why do I keep aiming to the right? You love the high minor Reddit? I, okay, I like. I see. I hate the high minor Reddit. I like. I do like what you said, though. When people like are like, question, and then answer, 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 answer. And you're like, whoa, that's, a, that's what I needed. That's the good feeling. But the, uh, I guess Reddit just falls from the, dude, you're helping me figure out my issue with Reddit. It's the, uh, the, the best comment, the top comment. That's just the pandering for the most up dudes. Cause it literally, it, it, it is, a. it started as a mockery of random internet points, but then turned into like a not mockery, which makes it not as cool. Which just makes it honesty, which is cool. But is it honesty if you're only going for the update? I don't know, man. I completely failed this. Oh, I got one apparently. That was just a random clicking. That's where mine mine goes, but I also know I'm just being a negative Nancy hipster. I've had this trait, <laughs> I've had this trait for a long time. <laughs> And I'm trying to work on it. Just let things be cool. Let people have their fun. I think most people are usually pretty good at that. Oh, we could have gone out this way. If you wanted to stealth it. I love how many options they have for stealth in this game. I'm being negative. I'm goddamn it. Plus. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> Okay, I see. I have a different take on that, Cthulhu. I have, I have a similar take on that. It was I was allowed to go on social medias, but I felt like I had to be uh, secretive about it. And then I got older, but I've always loved the. Oh my god, I love the internet. It's it's so nice. Just to con like to connect and find other people, you know, who have similar thought processes or worldviews as you, so you can grow together, you know. That's how that works. Or that's the that's the super innocent, nice look at the the internet. Because it's de it's definitely not like that all the time. So damn slow it's the slow, damn slow. We're going this way. JK. But it's already here. Okay, there she goes. Um, where was I going with that? I lost my train of thought. I also do that a lot. Um, but then you all right? I just decided like, hey, just use the internet. And don't be ashamed sure about it. Just use the internet. Spot. Just be a huge freaking nerd. And still be a human. And just connect like everyone else does. Bada bing, bada boom. And then once that once that switch flipped in my brain, I was like, oh my god. Oh my god. Not saying you need to change okay, who you are on. online, Fuck. but just accept it. Be fine with being a lurker, content. you know? Be chill, which Why I think. You come here? Yeah. Really? It's nuts. Wanted to do a story on the music at the Totentans. <laughs> no humanity condensed yes that is the internet it is humanity condensed that's a great way to put it uh, humanity anonymity uh, and then just a little micro dose of it a micro dose with a macro hit mm, juxtaposition paradoxical why does she keep sounding like she's in pain? Also, she's got a mox. She got um she got a mox freaking jean half top on that just says bitch on it. That's our baby. The internet is your yes, exactly though. Remember what we said earlier, Celeste or Cthulhu about the blank paper though? You just gotta figure it out. You just gotta figure it out. Oh, for fuck's sake! 
Take your life skills. They translate pretty well. I'm sure they do. Things you've learned, things you see other people learn. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Want to talk? How do you? Okay, here's here's another side wonder for you, I guess. Here's a side wonder for you. Um, this is a, a farther glimpse into Dry's insanity. Um, for for artistic right. endeavors, for artistic so endeavors, Carrie of course. Wants. That's always the disclaimer. Wants to bring back samurai. Um, game, because to write something, night. to be a writer. There is no. And I think uh, this is what I feel I've been struggling with. So I'm curious if you've been struggling with this as a writer as well. Um. We gotta do a gig. I'm gonna stand in for Johnny. I'll play for Johnny. Um, <laughs> I'm trying not to lose my train of thought. You. Let's just say Silver. I get more into character. I method act. I character act. Trust I take well, my life and I become the. Board, I become the empty vessel for the for character me? traits or the story I want to tell. Mentally, not actually in my all day to day, but I try to do tiny little things to like reinforce that character I'm trying to write in my head. And so for streaming, I've been trying to write like, okay, what do I like in streamers? What, what do I want to exemplify? What character do I want to be on the internet that helps reinforce my core beliefs and what I want to put out in the world? And that's how you, that's how I'm finding like my passion for what I want to do. And I think for a character, I see that in writing too, is for a character, you got to figure out your character's passion for what they want to do. And so then you just flip it and reverse it. You keep mulling each other over like the iron sharpens iron thing. You use that to reinforce your, uh, what's it called? The traits of the character and the traits of yourself. And then you're improving, your characters are improving, your writing's improving, your comfortability is improving, your confidence is improving. And then it just works, hopefully. <laughs> I haven't gotten that far yet, as you can tell, me streaming to three people. But that's the that's the thought process we're working on. Um and I like it. It feels good. It feels way better just being honest. You just gotta do it. You just gotta be comfortable. And if you aren't comfortable, you gotta figure out how to get comfortable. Cause that's all anyone else is doing. A reunion with some old Yeah? Does that make sense? Uh, come on. Am I crazy? Carrie and John or does that actually make sense? That's it. We just floated around. Give me feedback on that because I don't know. That's the other thing. So what do you want? An interview is I don't, you, you, no one knows anything. So it's literally, you, you just got to reach out and you got to go, yo, ass. dude, what's going on? I'd want <laughs> Am I right? Am I wrong? So Please yes. tell me if I'm wrong. Not a problem. <laughs> Not as far as I can see. Start with your interest. Yeah, it's that simple. And it's so, it feels so bad too when you're like, oh, it is that simple, man. I just wasn't, I just didn't have the right frame of mind for it. Just start with your interest. Explore those communities. Yes, plant. Try and fail. Uh-huh. You got to get back up. And yeah, don't be afraid when it feels right. That's the big one. Don't be afraid when it feels right. Trust yourself. You're smart. You know what's good. You know what's bad. For me, I, know I have a religious upbringing, a religious background. So for me, like right and wrong, that's always a strong moral thing in my head that no matter how try, how hard I try, you can't shake it, you know? Or you can shake it a little bit, but it always comes back. So having that, the right, wrong, the the light, the dark, you're good, you're bad. Uh, this is very like, Nez, I think, Nezchek? Is that the philosopher? That's That's being played on a ton right now in stories. And so that's why you always see that trope come up because it's, it's just a true trait that humans have. We have this good, bad, this light, dark, this constant battle in our heads. Because we all just want what's right for the world, right? So getting through that is, you gotta figure out your own good and bad, your own light and dark, or for your stories at least. And that's fun. That's a blast. pretty damn well. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm getting, I'm nerding out. I'm telling you how to do things. Don't do things how you want to do things. Don't do things how I want to tell you to do them. But it doesn't mean everything I say is wrong. Just translate it to your own brain. Yes, you'd word it differently. Yeah, I word things weird. That's why I'm not a writer. That's why I'm not a writer, man. Because I word things weird. <laughs> Be in touch. We agree, but we don't need the same words to describe them. Oh, it feels so good to hear you say that. You have no idea. <laughs> you have no idea. Call Carrie. Yep, she agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Oh, 
I love this song. Had some problems with this time. Uh, checked on the rest. Of the he doesn't care about Henry the maelstrom Daddy. stuff. Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. We're getting the band Great back story, together, baby. Actually. Henry didn't know. Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What? Me too? Why? You're gonna play with us, aren't you? You gotta meet the others. Send you the address. Okay. So we got our show. We got our show. I had a sniff. I got the sniffles. Um, give me a quick break. I gotta get water. I gotta settle down. I got too excited, Dave. You guys gotta be excited, which is good. I want to be excited, but I also want to focus on the game, guys. I still gotta play games. Okay. I still love this game. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go to Denny's Mansion. We'll probably finish out this Johnny quest. Um, and then we'll call it because we're coming up on three hours. Um, but I want to finish this stuff off. But yeah, then we'll be good. Fun fact, you got into writing because of Twilight. So yeah, write things that I thought would be cool to read. <laughs> okay, but was Twilight sexualized? I mean, a little bit. Getting, getting comfortable with things being sexualized is also, that's also part of the journey. Understand why that is in media, because it is, there's always a reason. There's always a reason. But Twilight is great motivation. <laughs> It has definitely inspired me as well in more ways than I think. I think it inspired a lot of people um, in our, in that, or who grew up, I guess, watching Twilight in like their mid teens or whatever, because you went, this is what's popular. Why is this popular? You know? And then this, your thoughts went, went crazy because vampires are cool. Dating a vampire would be cool no matter what gender you are or prescribed to or whatever. You gotta, you gotta break it all down. You gotta break it all down. Nothing is, what is it? I tell myself, this is what I tell myself. This is one of my, my mantras. Nothing is forbidden, but everything is sacred. Dwell on that for a little bit. Um, and I'll be, I'll be back in a bit. Tres que tus deseos más íntimos 
Dude, vampires and werewolves were definitely the hype in middle school. I remember, I remember, um, <laughs> this one's funny. This one's good. I remember doing Nickel, do you remember? Okay, Nickelodeon, the website. They used to have a whole bunch of games on there. And we got an ad. I'll tell it after the ad. I'll tell it after the ad. Gosh, dang it. I'll wait. Listen, I wait. YouTube, if you're hearing this, I freaking wait. I pause my stories for ads, okay? You don't miss nothing. But still, still subscribe, please. I, I didn't need those. I need, I need support. <laughs> I need it. <laughs> and I'm not ashamed to ask for it anymore. Okay, I'm a little ashamed to ask for it still, but I'm trying not to be. Shameless. I gotta be a little shameless in some places, right? To show that I can be shameless. To show that I can act. To show that I can act. I got my next two lines going. Let's go. Dude, it's so nice when I can focus. Holy frick. I swear I'm ADHD. But maybe I'm not. And maybe it is just there's there's too many things. I don't know. But I think that's why people say there's, they're ADHD. When they don't get checked up. Hey, what's up? Welcome back. Okay, I stopped my story. Don't worry. I stopped my story for the ads. Oh, I think we're good now. If Twitch is correct and it's... Ad timers, I guess. Um, oh, Jesus. Okay. First of all, come back here. Third of all, I got to take these guys out. And then I'm going to tell you about my Nickelodeon. Um, gamer days back in the day when I used to play flash games online. Because that somehow ties into werewolves and vampires. Aren't you so curious as to how and why? Aren't you? Aren't you so curious? Where'd he go? They go down here? Yes, they did. Hey. Get back here, nerds. This is when I want a better computer. I'm losing frames. Can't drive. If your movement's crippled. Oh, oh, he ran me over. Oh, I am fast, boy. I am fast. You think I'm not catching up to that? Come on. I'm hunting down my demons. I got to finish what I started. Oh, it's the only way to the top. Come on. Give me the car. Frick, they got away. Next time. Okay, story time. Um, ow. Um, I used to play, there's like a, a desktop version of like, not a desktop. It wasn't desktop. It was in browser MMO on Nickelodeon's website and they did a werewolf versus vampires like community event and I thought it was so cool but all it was all it was was like a little like drop in avatar chat room so I made my little dude who looked terrible because I could never make avatars back in the day 
which is why I put so much of an effort on it now, I think. Because <laughs> I like it. It's fun. Um, but yeah, I think I'd always go. I like, I'd always want to be a werewolf kid, but I think I'm a vampire kid at heart, like in all honesty. If I had to pick one and I'm sick of being a fence sitter, they're both cool, but I'd, I'd be a vampire guy. I don't know. Well, it's two different traits, isn't it? It's two different tropes. It's would you rather have a permanent um negative that you always know See those? that every time you're out in the day what happened here? She must have been renovating. Henry must have borrowed your weak. truck. It Gonk sucks. Always was good at or Maybe you have an uncontrollable home. transformation Try every What is a what is a lunar cycle? Twenty four days? You know, and then you figure out how that plays into your character traits. Right then. Guess we yeah, keep Yeah, I guess at heart. Yeah, if I if if Dry was a was a vampire or a werewolf. If Dry was a vampire or a werewolf, that is it. Those are the two options. It'd be a vampire. I'd be a vampire. Dude, was I right with the lunar cycles? Nice. Yeah. I just feel like I'd rather, I'd rather have the known, I'd rather have the known knowledge, you know? I want the known knowledge of my ailment as opposed to the, ah, uh, and to, to max, I want to maximize off of it, I guess, daily. I don't want it to be a disadvantage. I guess that's what I, that's where I draw my power from, of being a vampire or my route. But you'd need to drink blood. Yeah, that makes sense. That's fun. It's I'd rather I'd rather that because I can control that, right? But if I'm a vampire or if I'm a werewolf and I'm uncontrollable or something like that, because I think that's the I don't know, you you'd you'd have to now see that's the hard part. In this day and age when you're writing a vampire story or you're writing a werewolf or biting, wow, writing a werewolf story, you have to look at the history of a vampire. You know, you got to go all the way back to freaking Vlad Dracul to even before that to look at like imagery that that brought forth all the way to 2024, March 22nd, the most recent vampire thing. And you go, okay, what makes a vampire a vampire nowadays or a werewolf a werewolf nowadays? And then see which one of those things lines up with you, you know, like that's cool. That's cool. There's so much you can derive from that in a vampire or werewolf story. Oh, and then you, if, if you're in a video game, you distill that down into just one character. And then you have multiple characters that have that same super in-depth. Oh, so good. So fun. I'm, I'm nerding out. I'm geeking out. Let me play my game. <laughs> you fucking god. Who oh boy. Oh boy. Sounds sadly familiar. What are you doing here? This is really your house? This is your fucking pool? <laughs> You're gonna pay for this, you piece of shit! You bet I will! I like Just that. so I can come back again! Hey. Put uh, some men in here? Then, you'll tell me problem. why the hell you left me to die in the street! Left you to die? Ugh, I wish you would fucking die. Are you guys ready for me to break Why down this this entire quest line this that I've actually be been paying attention to? Yeah, I obviously I will. missed a few beats. What's Once we finish it, though, right. I gotta get the full story. No some sort of tour. So he flooded the pool with Introduce concrete. Me to the fam. Henry did often get emotional. Go anywhere near them and you're dead. You know what happened between them? I kid you not. From what I'll I've come to understand, fucking head off. one day, then he disappeared without a word, oh, then hid from Henry. They don't know. Imagine that wasn't too hard in his state of mind. Don't know what. Either that I lost years of my rehab. life to a scot bag yep. like you. That is, till I yeah. gave Henry her address. Fuck. Is that how you remember it? Remember a hell of a lot more than you. <laughs> What about the concert? I should, I'm just rereading that again, Cthulhu, and it's clicking more each time I read it. Good, though. <laughs> v, talk to them. Carrie will just make it worse. 
Uh, not really my biz. Go, go, they'll get past it in a sec. Carrie didn't piss all over himself out of joy when he saw me either. All right. How you guys doing? Is this your backup? In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Carrie sent me. It's about the concert. Oh, nice hair. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? Look, it's awkward. Carrie considers you both friends. What a sensitive guy. Shit. <laughs> I feel Given that. He's That's the one me. who set this flaming uh. turd bag on my doorstep. <laughs> we'll bring it back samurai. One night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet, but no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny! No, no way. Either him or me. Choose. Danny digs in her heels. We're done. Oof. How's it going? Like shit, man. Danny wants me out of the gig. And we already agreed on everything. What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. This is all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn. Don't make me I like choose. the golden baseball bat. Pretty sure it's your call. Yeah, it's Johnny's call. Fuck really pisses me off. Denny's on a control kick set in conditions. On the other hand, Henry's got scuff for brains. Can't trust him. Thanks. Yeah, look what he put in the... Real helpful. Look what he put in the pool, dude, freaking... Oh man, let's talk to him. Let's get a little Maybe info. Maybe someone tell me what happened. Their are artists, blind? their emotions are complicated. Maybe he had a good reason. Really, a reason? Denny is rightfully mad because her pool just got cemented. That's gonna cost a ton of money. Um, Henry, why'd you do this to her pool? You out of your fucking mind with the pool? You knew Carrie wanted to get Denny to play with us. Just wanted to clear the air. Fucking Prem. That... Now, Henry, that sounds like there's a lot more things to unpack. And v? I guess this isn't Help a therapy session, you. but... You gotta go without one or the other. Uh, yeah, not a problem. Should be able to borrow someone else for one gig. Won't be the same, though. It won't be the same. It won't ever be the same, Carrie. They don't know that I'm him. Oh, see, this, see, this is where the communication breaks down. If they just knew I was Johnny and I was playing yeah, for Johnny, they'd put aside their differences, hopefully. Maybe. Or maybe that's just what Johnny no. hopes. That's what the, the lead Henry role hopes. Or me. Can't be both. But you can't have both in this situation. This is, you can't be a fence sitter. You gotta pick. We're playing with Denny. Uh, if we gotta choose, you, let's Henry, play with Denny. Why did you do this to her pool? Fuck, Carrie! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me. Listen, Dude, I'll get you. You know what, Carrie? You cemented a whole Fuck pool. You. Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. He you is. Done? Get out. He showed his true colors. But he was just passionate about it. All right, what about Nancy? We make contact. She's going to set it all up. Isn't that fun? Not. Isn't that a fun way to do it? See you at the I show. love video games. Fuck. Now I got to find someone to clean this. Ooh, up. hello. Okay, about all we can do for now. Gold plated baseball Except bat. Wait for Nancy to call. Cool. Cool. Okay, so now we just gotta leave and wait for. Can I take your car? Yo. Dang it! I want his car. Maybe after the gig. Yeah, the gold bat really does match, and I'm so glad we actually just got it. Infused with Denny's Rage. High chance to apply bleeding. Low chance to apply stun. 198 damage per hit. Um. Oh, I thought I had non-lethal. Our knife has non-lethal on it. I forgot about that. We have a Pax knife. Okay. That entire quest line is about bringing... The, okay, bands... Do you know what bands symbolize in stories, guys? Do you know what bands symbolize? Musical bands? Um, artists coming together. Community. Like-minded individuals making art. 
extrapolate that into your daily life if you're an artist. <laughs> Break those down. Dude, maybe we close stuff out with River. Let's... So last time we hung out with River... Because we're, we're, we're waiting for a quest right now. We're waiting on so many quests right now. My goodness. I gotta do Sinner, man. I'm not excited to do Sinner, man. <laughs> I am excited, but I'm not excited. Sinner, man is one of those things where... It hits close to home for me with my religious upbringing. So it is going to be interesting to extrapolate on and deconstruct. And I won't lie, I'm a little, I'm a little afraid to. I'm a little afraid to. Because last time I did it, it was super good. But this time I'm doing it, I'm ask, actually asking myself questions. I'm going, frick man, this is a lot. <laughs> this is a lot. But that's just from three years. Two years? Ah, I'm excited to read that. Oh, I'm excited to play that one, actually. Oh, I'm pumped. Not tonight, though. Not tonight. That'll be an off-stream. That's personal. That's too personal for stream. I gotta... I gotta... Gotta break it out a little bit. I still gotta have time for myself to grow off-stream. Just always growing, chat. Always growing. Like a little... Vine of ivy going up the side of your house. Making sure it looks good, though. We're trimming the edges. It's gonna be pretty. Give it a nice little uh, lattice fence to climb up. Easy handholds. Get those leaves facing the sun. Nice little color wash out towards the edges. But still a nice deep green. What was I talking about? I try. I try. Thank you. But I legit I see life as metaphors. Life life is just metaphors and analogies. It's the easiest way to communicate to people because you say enough of them, someone's gonna understand what you're saying. You feel? <laughs> Cinnamon, yeah. Yeah, but we're past that already. Okay, okay, we're past that already. Yes, okay. That was thank you. Thank you. Back on stream. Back in character. God, I wish my computer was better. That's a want, though. That's not a need. I could be so much more immersed right now. Whew. So much more immersed, but it's fine. Where the frick are we going to see River? I don't know this place. Do I know this place? So backstory on River to get everyone up to speed. We have done two quests with this guy. He is a former cop slash detective who... Wait one second before we can start talking. Who got... What did he get? He... First was investigating a potential political attack, which then brought us into the Paralysis, who's the now mayor of the city in the current state of Act 3. He's done a quest with us where we investigated the kidnapping of his nephew, who was taken by the Peter Pan kidnapper, killer, who would take the children and put them in little, like, catacombic drug dreams horrifying horrifying as it sounds um because that's how he, that's the only way he knew how to help people because he was abused as a child taking care of cows because he worked on a farm where they just fed them drugs and then butchered them so that's what he thought the only good path was and so he was doing that to kids so that's what was happening to his nephew but his nephew got saved we saved his nephew and then he went home and then a few days passed and now we're meeting up with him again that is our drive. That is our motivation. That is our friend. Huh. I think it was here. Where is he? And why did he call us out here? 
Yeah. So that that's the mindset V's in right now. That's the mindset drives in right now. Patience is a virtue. Patience is a virtue. Let's wait a little bit. All right. I'm going full full involvement. Full invest. Oh yeah, okay. So this is his sister's house with his other oh, nieces hey. and nephews right here. Hi. Hey. How's it going? Over here. Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. What? What's on the menu? We're just Jumbalaya. being boys. Come on. You can stir the meat. This is um, so nice. Soy meat. Okay. No, maybe Joss would be more help. Deflect Just a little bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start. Oh, stirring. this is good. This is good. This an ancient ward family secret. Uh huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. I just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. This is a man stir. who's been through shit, and now he's healing, and he just needs a friend. And V, who's a merc, and needs some time to relax, hanging out with some friend. And that's what this is. Honestly, I thought you were kidding about the cook-off. With the Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... How? Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Hey, man. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities Only lately. to spoil a nice day, but... Frick, I didn't want to ask this yet. That's fine. What about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. We'll talk later, sure. okay? No pressure. It's just I, uh... You know, I know. Hey, you got to check up on your friends. Check up on your friends, by the way. All right. Even if you think they got Thank it, you, ask enough. them. That's how. That's why you're the Mind friend. Grabbing the rice from the kitchen. <laughs> yes, sir. Always gotta ask. <laughs> that's I'm working on stuff like that right now, to be vulnerable for a moment. No, Randy's always been that way. But, but we I all gotta work on it, you know. You know, his father was a difficult man, too. That's hey. exactly what I told him. But he always got the same speech back. Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. How you doing, Joss? I'll call you back later. Really nice of you to come. Uh, thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. My 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 inner polite little Midwestern boys coming up. Yeah, it does depend on who you're vulnerable to, and that's that's the scary Still part, isn't it? That's Still the scary shock, part. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. Uh it's over now. That's what matters. Put it behind us. We don't gotta dwell. What matters is it's over now. We gotta heal him. Help him heal. They need someone to say it. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy uh, had... Don't owe me a thing, Joss. Thank you. Merva's in the backyard. He couldn't wait to see you again. Aww. Dude's our friend. That's Maddie. He nice. just needed your friend. Please, nothing bad. Oh, thank goodness. <sighs> I've, been I've, been, I've been watching too many horror movies. <laughs> uh, your next. That's another thing of... Now you can toss in the rice. Knowing how to relax. Especially as a Merc in Night rice City, in. man. Oh my gosh. It's, okay. Think about how much murder we've over. committed. How much life we've ended. How, how do we sleep at night? Soundly. Unless we can find some time to relax and decompress with... With friends and a beer or something else oh yeah that rice see all that all that all that in there that's that the rice is gonna soak up all those good flavors oh that's actually gonna be a phenomenal little little pot of something something and now we sit and chat it's nice out here yeah it seems all good like nothing bad ever happened tell me now about harris I paid him a visit at the hospital. 
follow suit, match his vibe, we're friends. He's still in a coma. Don't push the question. Don't jump to conclusions. Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. We're thinking the same thing, man. I had the same thought. See? It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River? How my parents died. Now, you sure you want to hear this? Oh, there's always there's always some trauma. Let's get it. Get it out, boy. What happened? Old man had a farm like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn. When someone says, do you want to hear this right now? My parents managed to. They got to get it grocery. out. But it's we okay to say no. Floor above. It is okay to say no, but maybe in the future. A loud noise woke us one night. You don't got to share that kind of trauma with everyone. Cash. Register but you do got to share it with someone. Upstairs. <laughs> Even a therapist. Us all to kneel. And demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. Let him go. He's got to get it out. Sometimes, Mostly I remember even if it's hard to say. Crying. My dad swore they'd found all we had. It's crazy how easy it sounds. <laughs> he fired first. Blew half my dad's skull off. Jeez. Jesus, River. I'm sorry. He was erratic. Went rabid. Handed me his gun and ordered me to aim it at my mom's head. I can still see her tear-filled eyes at the end of that barrel to this day. What did you do? Nothing. I stood frozen. Finally, he just snatched the gun back. Shot my mother and they laughed. He made River try to kill his gone. mom? Oh my goodness. That was why I joined the force. I couldn't agree with scum like that. Yeah, that would brain. instill a slight sense of justice oh, in your brain. An unobtainable justice because it happened. Oh, poor River, man. Was just there too? Saw all this? Mm -hmm. I think when she looks at me, she still sees that boy holding a gun to her mom's head. Oh! can't tell you how sorry I am. That just broke open their family dynamic. So when I stood over Harris in that hospital bed, barrel to his brow, I was that kid again. But I was also the junkie who shot my parents. <sighs> Take a drink after that one. I understand. Yeah, as a merc, we get I've it. A few lives in my we time, get it. But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. But what now? You're not going back to the PD. PI has a nice ring to it. Who True. Knows? Uncle River, we'll you said you'd play with us. You promised. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's go. Me? You join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. Just boys Go being boys. Dang, yeah. River. Big trouble in Haywood. Grab yourself. Big trouble in Little Haywood. Oh, wait. We're playing freaking laser tag, baby. I've never done this. What is this? I've never done this before. think always wanted to try a game like this wait this would be sick well well nice firepower there this is no time to get distracted <laughs> can't let that filth get away who oh well look at you v, dude allow me to introduce i'm Captain just playing a 2012 youtube Callahan. video and they're our precincts best and brightest wouldn't want to get in their way i always work alone no exceptions, even for you. Yeah, me too. 
Ooh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone Hype wolf up the type. kids. Hype up That's the kids. Right. Thorns in their commander's side. Exactly. Exactly. I've been suspended one time, retired two times, and kicked off the force three times. Oh my gosh. So I'm edgy. I'm too old for this, but something always drags you back. <laughs> the city needs me. Got a crash course? Anything I ought to know? Break character for the a second. The entire city is sick with crime and corruption. Lawlessness rules the streets. And we're no saints either. Even the police are haunted by the sins of their past. But the city's without hope. No one else would ever dare face El Chamuco and Diablado. Oh, the freak. He's the worst. But I know we can beat him. The city's most evilest mastermind ever. I'm so curious to see what what it is that we have All to right. shoot. Let's get to it. This is so All good. Right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco and Diablado and take out what does that mean? along the way. Spanish speakers. He'll pay for his crimes. Inform me. I'm ignorant. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids. But we work toward the same objective. I love games like that. Best result wins. You don't stand a chance. That's my favorite type of game. AV, like actually. It's so easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Let the kids win. That's such a good, that's such a good quest objective. <laughs> oh, there he is. Get him. The city's mine. You'll never think of Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice. Watch out. It's his cronies. Bang. He's hit. He's hit. Not half bad. Bang. I got to keep it close. I got to keep it close. Alright, I gotta play this up though. Frick, they, they probably saw me. They, they probably saw me not shoot. Smell the moral decay from a mile off. Quiet. Too quiet. Takes position. It's a trap. They were waiting for us. Not half bad. Bang! Bang! He's hit. Bang! He's bang! Hit. Oh my gosh, bang. All you got. Bang. Bang. -uh. Watch this. I've got our okay, flank. That's all of them. But next time we gotta be faster. <laughs> I was made for this mission. I was made for this mission. A child at heart. Huh. Huh. Out of the way, citizen. Obstructing justice is punishable by law. Take him out. Is your last warning. Easy there. Captain, I'm just passing through. <laughs> I thought that was just an actual guy. <laughs> hey, I have better aim. Now. That's so good. Don't charge in there, Callahan. I can't afford to lose one of my best men. Don't worry about me. Also, that kid up front, that's River's jacket from the earlier quest, which is so funny that it's his nephew doing the same thing. <laughs> or niece. <laughs> I can't tell with their voices. They're just kids. I think nephew. I think that's the boy. Oh, bang, bang. Uh, he's hit, he's hit. One sec, I'm gonna turn off my music for this. Okay, I think we got them all. But it's not over yet. Oh my gosh! Fine. Out with it, scumbag. I want to see you squirm. No! Your last words! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, come on. Another ambush? Okay, so now. Lunch is ready. Mm, but, Mom, you almost had him. We almost had him. him. Oh, you'll get him next time. At least we beat the grown ups. Frick! They beat us. Thanks for letting them win. They had fun. 
Huh? Oh no, they had me flat beat. Hey, food's on the table. Says it with a smirk, with a little smile. Let's go, River. Enjoy your meal. Turn his so, music back on. Was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too. What the? He was happy that he kicked our butts. Time to see if this tastes <laughs> as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get through those years back. True River. I haven't seen him this untroubled in a while. Feels good. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Street kid. Open Haywood. Whole street. Haywood's the fam, baby. Neighbors helped each other out. Thought nothing of it. Nothing's more important to me than my kids. Aww. I've made mistakes. Life's gone off the rails sometimes. But I had my kids. Some people really do just need kids. kids. Not everyone. Not everyone. Hear that. Hear that. Not everyone. But some people, kids are good for them, man. They help remind them why they're doing it. I'm not about to say be great if Randy was here. Joss, you see me being a parent. Personally, I'm, I'm not a... I don't think I want kids in my life. I'm gonna be honest. I mean, I don't exactly look like. I'm, I'm enough of a child myself, myself so. you know. Yes. Who says yes? <laughs> I do. <laughs> he raised his hand himself. <laughs> v, are you seeing someone? Involved? Fess up, please. Um. Well, that's decided. <laughs> Classic. That's my response to is. Eleven ninety nine. Um, Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Classic. That's a, see, that's a good friend right there. Pulls you out of the awkward questions from other people. <laughs> thanks, Joss. <laughs> yeah, thanks. But also, you got to put your friend on the spot sometimes, too. <laughs> the situation too. was getting dicey. Iron sharpens iron. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. But you still gotta cool down the sword. Ooh! Here we are. Blacksmith analogy. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. Great for what? Having a drink? Shooting the shit. Do not make a pass at me, please, River. He might. This way. Oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Let me be cool guy. Fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. Easy. Boost me. Yeah. Okay. Good. Huh. Open. Ugh. Okay. Nice. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. I didn't do River's oh, quest last dazzle. time, and I should have. This is a good though. quest line. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. These no worse places to raise kids. These cyberpunk these riders really knew what they were doing. I will say that. Pop out of thin air. True, but Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble. They hit a lot of very uh front. They hit a lot of problems in Night City that we hit nowadays, but just they just have them translated up to cyberpunk status, which is sick. This is the game. Um, but also helps provide a really cool way for them to tell us the story Apparently they want to tell. Worst city between the Atlantic That's how you know it's good. Pacific. It all reinforces itself. But I sure do love this view. Oh. Find it calming. A little French. French audience, please translate. I got nothing. I'm ignorant. Dude, French is such a freaking hot language. I will say that though. Oh my gosh. Out here, you can't smell the shit the corpse dump on the It's streets. so sensual. Like the city's their own personal toilet. Oh, look at that. That's shit. a shot. Flush repeat. Mm. Poetic. Couldn't have said it better. Got something for you. Oh. Oh. 
Your peace? Matter a long time. Too long. I think it's time she found a new honor. To know what to say. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. <laughs> Family landmark? Something of the kind. Now for the highlight of the evening. Oh? Up for a drink? Something strong is sure to hit the spot. Now that I understand. Pushes me off water tower. Yes, that's a great way of saying it, Cthulhu. The narrative is smooth enough. Yes. See, you could kiss. This is your option. Role playing game. But I want friendship. That's what V wants out of River. That's what V and River give to each other. It is friendship. In this harsh city. The friendship. V's still to married friendship. to Haywood. To the idea of being that shooting star. More that two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. Who slowly fades out we'll into existence. That. Buckle your liver in. Gonna be a long or out of night existence. And a longer morning. <laughs> Fades to black. Oh, uh, Cthulhu, have you ever watched the movie uh, Beneath the Silver Lake? Andrew Garfield, uh, Modern Noir. Oh, now where did I put that? That movie really helped me understand what I want to do as a writer a lot more. And I would recommend watching it. With the with the intent of not, oh, this is a cool movie. One, it is a great movie. But two, with the intent of dissecting it and analyzing it. Think of it like, I, I, I thought of it, my thought process was, I'm going to watch this with the idea that I'm going to be graded on a report. <laughs> To write this Colonizer but i still enjoyed it because it's fun and, there's still no and it is oh that movie's so freaking well. good at least we had fun yesterday it's pretty it's pretty yeah. on the nose that smooth narrative I'll that you're talking about it's a great I'd way to say it Randy. or a relatable no narrative i guess is a back. better way to say it, it. As much time more as accurate so randy hey we'll do see you later v nice Complete Riverward story quest line. Yeah, we got a freaking Chivo. Awesome. Yeah, and also if you don't, no biggie. Just something I think you might think is cool. Um, Beneath the Silver Lake. I think it was a 2022 film. It's on Max, HBO Max, and it might be on other things, but that's that's just where I watched it. And I'd say I'd put that out once again to anyone who wants to learn more about writers slash characters slash see into the budding artist in the 20, 22s, 2020s, see what they're going through or have to go through, I guess, in a Dante Inferno's esque as you like story. Not actual Dante's Inferno, but kind of a little bit. It draws parallels. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um. Ooh, yes. Nice. I got my my pistol upgraded. All right, let's go flex this for a second, and then we're gonna call it because I've been streaming for almost four hours, which is usually my limit, and I've had a blast today. And I want to get back into Dragon's Dogma off stream and see if it keeps crashing. Because that's going to be my next hey, obsession. It's all set up super sweet like tonight at the Red Dirt. Oh, perfect. Talk to Carrie? Didn't change his mind or anything? No, no, not at all. He's pretty stoked, in fact. Nice. I haven't seen him like this since the Silverhand days. What about Henry? Still not on board? <sighs> Didn't even try. Not wasting my breath on that dick tip. Well, so, see you tonight. <laughs> and don't worry about your axe. 
Got the gear all rounded up. Henry might... Henry might have been the wrong choice to deny access to the concert, considering how Henry is. Um, I should have thought about that beforehand. I should have thought about that beforehand. Um, I am not going to embers. I'm just trying to find someone to slaughter with my pistol. And then we're going to call it. Because everyone needs a break. And I got to upload this to YouTube. I need to make a thumbnail still for my cyberpunk VODs. Okay. We're looking for baddies. We're not going into embers because that's the whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you sure you want to do this? Once you go past this point, there's there's nothing you can do. Watch out! twice guys I was on I was on your side why did you shoot me I'm so bad with this pistol man dude says as I slaughtered him with a pistol. This is Johnny's old pistol too. It feels so good. Okay. So I don't know if I like this yet. That was focus mode. I just haven't got the, I haven't got the, it doesn't have the chunk I like yet. Who would have thought we'd be so shy of a sudden? Jesus. Right. Shoot. Uh. Surround him. Where the frick's my car? Stand there down. it is. Get out of here. Oh my. Driving a vehicle. Transmitting further details. Reflex build. Reflex build. Reflex build. Hey. Why don't you just, uh. Hi, Mars. You came at the very end. Hi, Ben. You guys came at the very end. I'm literally, this is the last thing I'm doing. What up, guys? We're, uh, we're pretty cool. We're testing out the new weapons. We're, uh, getting the cops on us. Uh oh. Damn the cops Kill. off of us. Stand down. Get Getting the cops off of us. Useless piece of shit. Reflex build. Gonna be a slaughter. Reflex build. Hey. Why are there cops everywhere? Exchanging fire! Did you get Dragon's Dogma working? No. I'm trying that off stream. <laughs> That's after this. That is after this. Or at least that's what I'm telling myself. Yeah, I'm freaking bummed. It kept crashing. It crashed three times. On the, uh, the create a character menu. Oh, the worst.
I'm trapped. I'm fishing a barrel right now. Oh, you fucked now! Oh, frick. Give him hell! Where's my car, man? Where's my bike? I can't get caught on those edges. I want the five stars. At, at this point, I want the, the fifth star. That was such a small explosion. Exchanging fire. Ah. Jesus, okay, I gotta get off the main streets. Yeah. No, barbed wire. Graphics are, yes, things are tearing, things are ripping. Um, any support goes to dry getting a new PC, um, Twitch Prime. <laughs> so that way I can play these games at the level I'm capable of. That sounds so arrogant, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, I just want my picture to look pretty. Okay, we're losing it now. We're not getting five. It's fine. Let's see. Okay, that's the game. I need that co -processor. Oh, you guys were talking about what Dragon's Dogma. I just apply like, that yeah. to my own life because I think everything's about me. <laughs> um. Yeah, dude. Drag the, so, the, so the Dragon's Dogma, do you know why the cooking scene looks good? Do you know why the cooking scene looks good? You just hype me up. You know why? I know about this. I know about this. Someone say primes. Hey, oh, thanks, boys. Um, but I know about this. So the dragon's dogma cooking, all the food looks so freaking good because they just took a, a HD video, an ultra HD video of someone cooking and they just did performance cooking. So the graphics are really good because it's a super high quality video. That's like 10 seconds or whatever. Because that's so much cheaper to make than trying to spend all that time and energy as a 3D model is to make that. No, I'm not lying. That's literally what it is. That's okay. That's what I think it is. That's what the one. Okay, gosh dang, I got to backtrack my hype. Backtrack my hype. That is what I heard on the internet. Gosh dang it. Which to me makes so much more sense. I need to, I need to rewatch it and reanalyze it slash once I'm in game. Um, I'll retroactive on that but to me i was like that makes so much sense doesn't it we're we're when we're, we're, we're at the day and age where photo real photo realism is like important just take a picture we have the tech for it Whoop. there it is hey thanks mars for the 10 months hi hi do you like the new little pop the new little thingy. I got to recolor some of those. Gosh dang it. You, Mars, whenever I talk to you, you, you make me want to make better art. Gosh dang it. You're my, you're my, like my social link for better art inspiration. All right. But I gotta, I gotta stop streaming. This is my allotted stream time. Um, <laughs> you do, you do take that as a compliment. I said that with a smile. Don't you worry. Um, yeah, we're going to, we're going to stop streaming today. Good time. I got plenty of stuff to work on. Have a grand Friday. Have a grand evening. This is a blast. Cthulhu, good luck writing. My bit rate is 1000. What is going on? Why is my internet being so trash right now? It's a good time to stop.